Welcome to the final game of the Champions League group stage this season. We're in Marseille. We're taking on Olympic Marseille. And this stadium looks fantastic here. Can't wait to get started in this game. This game decides who qualifies number one for the group. We do not want to finish second in the group. But we also want to rest some of our important players. That's exactly what we've gone and done for today's lineup side. And you'll see in a sec, I've pretty much put out a second team here. But a second team that will get the job done, in my opinion. Well, here you see the group stage. Four wins, one draw. I think we're the team that gave Marseille their loss. The goal difference. The draw will do. I take a draw right now, to be honest. But, you know, we're basically set up for a draw, to be honest. But we still have that attacking trait in us. That if we can catch them on that, we'll try and do it. But to look at the Marseille side. Madonna in goal. Let's have a look at anyone else who recognizes that team. Germain Thorvin Payet. Okay, so they got some Luis Gustavo, of course, for a Bayern Munich player. It's good players there. Thorvin Payet, two danger men. Go watch out for them too. Well, here is the United side. Albon, Lafon starts in goal. Yeah, then Twin TV, Lindelof, Sessignon in the back. Fozzi Menza, Barkley, midfield. Angel Gomez in the cam. Rara, Dahlberg, and Kluver finish off the top three and on the bench we have some talent there if we need to you know guys like Rashford should be there Herrera Matic so pretty well stocked in case we need them oh Foz Menza can pick out Angel Gomez Gomez oh it's right of the keeper oh what a job what a job Foz Menza can he get around him cross the ball in Gomez Pereira, Talberg, Fulcer Barkley, Fulcer again, oh, Gomez, big up Pereira, the space there, Pereira now, just slotted away, Gomez is over the top, Pereira's a storming start to the session, behind the team, Pereira, oh what a save, that is a sublime save, Talberg takes it back, Goes Menza. This is it. This is a quick football so we want to see. Well, don't have time for anything. Half time is approaching really quickly in this game. It is nil-nil, but it is being all one-way traffic for us, I think, really. But having a pie any goals, having any shots. Perfect first half, I'd say. There you go. Half time. Olympic Marseille. Nil. I United. Nil. Like I said, Cessnion. Cessnion a bit of a run here. Sessnock by left mid himself has a crack inside. Beats him inside. Finds Pereira. Cross comes in. Back post to Cliver. That nearly could have been a good one. Oh, here's the attack. We knew it was coming from Olympic Marseille in that second half. Payet tries to go past Lindelof and dispossessed. And CB knocks up the foes of Menza. What can we see here? Foes of Menza does him. Does him like butter. Now the space opening up. Cliver. Can he pick out? No, nope. we'll win this a corner. We'll take it. Rare to whip it in. Can we get another good cross? And that's a good one. It's right there. It's falling. Ah, it doesn't fall for the guy. Can he pick out Clivert? Yes, he can. Clivert. Foz Menza. Foz Menza. Can he shoot it? Oh. That was worth the chance. Where's the counter? Gomez. Still knocked up. Gomez. It's John Riedlin, the American sprinter. It's Yedlin. Where's the space opening up? Oh, just poor finish. Twin CB, Yedlin. Oh, beautiful game between the two of them. Picks out Clivert. Clivert now. Clivert whips it across the goal. That should have been 1 0. Well, here's the substitution time. Rojo, Juan Mata and Joe Prayer coming on. Victor Lindo had a fantastic game. Gomez is injured and Albert Lafont has not done anything today. Picks out Rojo though. Rojo keeps it in. Rojo whips it in. Foza Menza! Never got the connection we needed out of it. Luver now. Oh, goes around the back of him. Is there space there? Inside ref, where's the free? Where's the free ref? Here come Marseille, first break through the line. Oh, chance here. They've had one chance and they've made it. I can't believe it. 
Disbelief. Well, it's been one-way traffic. It's been united all the game. And then one missed tackle. Yedlin caught no man's land. The one-two. Joel Pereira misses the save. So close to a famous victory now. Heartbreaker. Stuck his own half. Mata. Quick passes. Dahlberg. Can we steal that point now? Sure, this is the last chance saloon. Yedlin. There's no one there in the box. That's so close to the keeper. Why is it there? Like anywhere but there, guys. Last chance saloon now. We've got to get this. Ref, where's the free? Oh, this is a disaster. Make the tackle, that's it. Take him out. That's game over. Well, it's a disaster. An absolute disaster. They had one chance all game, and they took it. That's it, one chance. And that is going to mean we're going to play an elite team in the next round. It's going to be difficult to admit, but it's disappointing. Disappointing result. One shot, one goal. I mean, that was basically their entire game. They got one chance. They put it away. We had plenty of them. And then put them away. Fair play to Marseille. A 1-0 win for them in the final group stage here game here of the Champions League. Congrats to them. Well, the stats tell you everything you need to know about this game. One shot, one goal, one shot on target. I mean, we had 10, four on target, couldn't put it away. So, you know, that was the second team, but it's not good enough. Fair play to Marseille. They had their one chance. They took it. We didn't take ours. Player ratings here for the game. Not a very great game. No eights for the team at all, really. Just a poor performance overall, I'd say. Session on the seven. Rojo with the seven. 7.5. Trent CV. 7.3. For Yannick, the back four is pretty good. Then Love picked himself up with 7.6. Oh, he was fantastic. Those men's in Barkley midfield, 7 3 and 3 and a 7.5. Pretty good game. Rara was good in the first half, kind of fading that second half to 7.7. Dahlberg 6.5. Mata with a 5.9 coming out at half time. Uh, Gomez 6.7. Unfortunately, Gomez picked up a knock. I would love to see a bit more, but that seems to hamper him in the game. 6.5 for Clivert and Alba on the font 6.1 with Prayer at 5.7. The legal keepers are good today, but very much do today. So, yeah, unfortunately. Didn't capitalize on the results. A poor, poor loss there, really, to be honest. I know it's a second team, but we're now going to be tasked with a difficult Champions League opponent in the knockout stage. Let's see who our Champions League opponent is going to be. We're going to crack in onto the screen, check out the group final group standings, and then we're going to crack on and see who our opponent is in the round of 16. Hope it's not a Real Madrid, a Barca, or a Bayern, because that would be a disaster. But let's go find out right now. Here is the final standings in Group D, our group, and, well, I mean, we scored 17 goals, conceded for 13 goal difference, and we finished second. You win some, you lose some, don't you? But yeah, Marseille qualifying on top, they had five wins, just the one loss. Of course, that draw against Villarreal for us, away to them. Pretty poor on our side, we beat them at Old Trafford, so... I mean, we got no one to blame but ourselves for losing that game or drawing that game in Villarreal. It was poor. Really should put them away, but didn't. Villarreal finished third. They go into the Europa League and Celtic, of course, no wins. Come on, Celtic. You've got to turn up in the Champions League. Yeah, I think at the end of the day, could be a lot worse, but I'm happy we qualified. That's the most important thing. Now we're in the knockout stage. It's a whole new tournament. Let's see a look at the teams we can face. Go back to Group A and see who qualify the top. Okay, so we can face Paris. Disaster, you don't want to face them. Real Madrid, oh boy, can we avoid them, please? Atletico Madrid, another side I'd like to please avoid. Marseille, can't get them, I don't think. Bayern, okay, brilliant. Yeah, we'd love to get Bayern. Nope, no thanks. Juventus, yeah, no thanks. Barcelona, no thanks. Chelsea, I'd take Chelsea. I think we can absolutely annihilate Chelsea. We've done back to back years, so hoping it's Chelsea. That's it. So. One of eight odds there. So let's have a look. Switch the tournament tree. Who do we have in the knockout stage? Barca Sporting, Atletico versus who knows who. Real Madrid, Leverkusen, Juventus. Oh, bloody hell. It's Juventus. 
Three games, Paris, Ajax, Bayern Munich, Monaco, Chelsea, Bordeaux, and Olympic Marseille versus Besiktas. Well, well, well. It's going to require a miracle, but you're going to have to do it. So, we have Juventus. Oh, boy. I do not have a good track record against Juventus in FIFA games and knock out Champions League. They always seem to find a way to beat me in the end, but can we rid the curse this time around? That will be the answer come January, but yeah, disappointing, but hey, that's it. Anyway, let's wrap it up here, guys. Hope you guys enjoy your day. See you guys very soon.